Hey everyone, Rob J here, and welcome back to the Nova, and welcome to Stairs. Stairs is a first-person atmospheric psychological horror game inspired by real-life events that takes the players through the stories of three missing people as seen through the eyes of journalist Christopher Adams. It was developed by Greylight Entertainment and published by Digital Tribe. I'm playing this game today because it was recommended to me on Instagram, and this is the first time I'm playing a horror game on my channel. I have no idea how well I'm going to do with this. Probably pretty bad because I'm pretty bad at horror games, but you never know. Anyways, let's just get right into it. I'm ready to be scared and spooked. I hope there's not a lot of jump scares. Because <laughs> I'm just going to be like, ugh! Anyways, let's go. <sighs> Here we go. My name is Christopher Adams. Freelance journalist looking for a new story and someone to sell it to. Lately I've been looking into three missing people, but with no luck. Valerie Berkeley, James Reed, and Jean Jowers Remens. Berkeley was allegedly kidnapped by the other two and is presumed dead. There was no ransom note, no exchange. All three simply went missing for three years. Until now. Police found the body of a young female yesterday in the old factory outside of town. According to my contact, it was Berkeley, killed by strangulation. So why would a kidnapping victim turn up dead three years later? Are Reed and Remens still involved somehow? I'm on my way to the factory now. If nothing else, I'll get some photos before anybody else does. Okay, here we go. Okay, movement. That's not too bad. Okay, well, it's nice scenery. This looks, looks like a pleasant game. Okay, here we go. Let's speed up a little bit. Hmm. Jaded journal, okay. Oh, I see. These are, these are controls. Okay, take photo, toggle camera, photos. Neat! Okay, well, such a pleasant day. I think I thought out shift. Hmm. Yeah, shift is to sprint. This is a good game. This is a good game so far. I'm impressed. <laughs> of course, there's going to be more to it than just like walking a peaceful path, you know, like I'm sure there's going to be some jump scares eventually or someone's going to be like, hey! Anyways, here's a factory. Okay. Hmm. Let's see, take a picture? Is that, is that good enough? Okay, cool. Hmm. Okay, let's see where I can go. So this is the factory. There's gotta be somebody to get in here. Whole shift to run. Yeah, I, I kind of figured that out already, but it's okay. What the hell is that? Okay, it's daylight. Nothing can be scared in the daylight, right? Okay. Okay. Control the couch. Okay. Okay. I am kind of creeped out right now. What did I write my journal? I got into the factory. The crime scene should be should be close. I should look around and take all the pictures I need. Okay. I got a battery life and everything. I wonder how you zoom in. Hmm. You know, we'll just take pictures of whatever I see that that's kind of like... Okay. Hit each interact with objects. Okay. Nothing scary yet. Nothing scary yet. 
I'm taking pictures of random things. I just I feel like if I don't take pictures right now, it's gonna suck for me in the long run. So, hmm. Okay, let's see. What's in here? <laughs> okay. Hmm. Okay, you know, I'll go upstairs once I open this up first. Oh, it's locked. Shit. Hmm. Okay, I guess I'm going up. Is there a flashlight? Nope, I have no flashlight. Okay. And that adds the ambiance of scariness. Okay. That's locked too. Okay. Oh, oh, okay. <laughs> okay, let's go in. <laughs> okay. I am not comfortable right now, as it's so freaking dark. Okay. Okay. Okay, let's get out of here, let's get out of this dark room. Let's take a picture of this. What the hell was that? What was that? Okay. Okay. I I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm, I'm okay. Um... Speed up a little bit here. Is someone... Ooh... Someone's in here with me. I don't know. I just don't want anything to be dark anymore. Okay. Okay, does that go in the whole circle here? Hmm. I came through there, did I not? No, I don't think I did, because the door wouldn't be. Um, yeah. Okay. I'm not gonna lie, my anxiety is like through the roof right now. I just don't like the idea that I'm so helpless. Oh, I can close doors behind me. I should've been doing that in the first place. He's probably been following me or some crap like that if it's like a... Hmm. I think this is new. Maybe it's not. Oh. Fantastic. Okay. Okay. Yep. I'm scared shitless right now. I'm closing doors. Okay. So I think I take pictures of the only thing that, that that's relevant. Let's see. Looks like they stayed in here. Beer, TV, and and, uh, and a sofa. What more could you want? I don't know. Maybe not being a daredevil and freaking... Whatever. You know, I wish there was a flashlight somewhere. I'm just so freaking scared right now. Okay. Came through. Oh, oh. Let's follow the light. 
follow the light. Okay. Oh god. Oh god. Please close the door. Oh no, the door's ripped off. Okay. Okay. She was restrained here. That much is clear to see. What did they do to the poor girl before killing her? I don't know. Maybe the idea is not to be in here for that long and getting out. I'm super uncomfortable right now. I just don't want to miss anything, you know? Like if I miss like a certain key element or... So she slept on a mattress. Can I go up here? Nope, it's blocked. I already took pictures of that. Did I go in the spooky door? I don't know, did I? This is scaring the crap out of me. I just don't know what to do right now. Yep, hearing crap. Ah! There we go. So I'm guessing the journal saves his checkpoints, right? Because look, um, no blood or signs of a fight. Why strangle her? Why strangle her out here? Or did they move the body? Hmm. Oh man, is it gonna be down there? Ah, oh, for love of God, really? I took a picture of that, right? Well, just in case. Because you know me, I'm just trying to avoid any possible ways of dying quickly in this game. Okay. Yeah. I gotta take the plunge and go down. Down into like the jump scare haven of this game. Oh man, this is gonna suck. Oh. Hmm. Um, isn't that relatively important? It looks like there were torture weapons there. Ish. Okay. Well. I am not down with this at all. I just don't want to miss anything though, like I'm just I'm really scared of missing something that you know I could have used. No, there's nothing in here either. Okay, let's go back out to the scary world. <sighs> nah, I can't track with that either. Hey, look, let's go down a pitch black doorway. Nah, there's nothing there either, eh? Okay.
Okay. So I came in through here. I'm like, oh, cool, look at that. And I went down over through here. I decided to go down this way, I think. Took a picture of that. Now we go down here. Okay. And now we go deeper. Hey, look, it's stairs. Okay. This is a ballsy journalist. Like, a very, very ballsy journalist. 